All right, so in today's video, I wanted to talk about air dryers. So an air dryer is basically a cartridge that has a desiccant bed in it that helps remove moisture from the air, primarily water. And back here, you can see that you have a, a wire going to it for the sensor. You have air, two air lines here and one air line down here at the bottom. So basically what this is, is it's air coming in uh, that's basically going through the desiccant to get the water removed from it before it sends that uh, air to the tank. And then down at the bottom, there's a purge valve. So a lot of times, if you're not familiar with diesels and semis, when you hear that psh that the trucks do, uh, that happens when the compressor reaches cutout pressure. So when that happens, the governor sends an air signal through a pilot line right here to signal this guy that it's time to purge uh, this guy. So you'll hear that psh where it's purging out and it's getting rid of that moisture that it collected or at least some of it. Uh, these things are serviceable where you have to replace the cartridge every so often. Uh, the interval when you should replace these depends on the air usage of the truck. So some of them will be like one year and some of them may even go up to three years. So if you're not using a lot of uh, air, uh, like an over the road truck that doesn't do a whole lot of stop and go, you're probably gonna be able to go longer without replacing it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here and look at one that's sitting on the shelf so you can get a better view of the bottom side of what these guys look like. So this is the bottom side of an air dryer and you can see the purge valve down here at the bottom and you can see that it has three bolts holding this cover on. Uh, if you work on a lot of trucks, you're probably going to end up doing a lot of rebuilds on these uh, purge valves because what happens is they get gunked up. Uh, air compressors will pass oil. Some of that oil may find its way in here. Oil mixes with water, forms a sludge, gets this thing all nasty. Plus you also get road dirt and debris up in it sometimes. So quite frequently you'll take these off, pull them out, buy these little kits that come with new O-rings and clean it up, replace the seals in it, put it back together. It's a pretty quick job once you've done it a few times. Um, but that's what an air dryer does, right? It removes the uh, water moisture from the air and then it purges it. So I hope this kind of cleared up what air dryers do a little bit. If you have any questions about the air dryers, please make sure you put them in the comments. Uh, I'll be more than happy to answer them. If you have ideas about other parts of the truck you want me to make a video about, also a good thing to put in the comments.